In this video, we are going to see about Ohm's law. Ohm's law is a formula used to calculate the relationship between voltage, current and resistance. George Simon Ohm in 1827 described measurements of applied voltage and current through simple electrical circuits containing various lengths of wire. Consider the length of the conductor to be L and A is the area of cross-section of the wire. When a potential difference V is applied across the wire, a net electric field E is created in the wire. If we consider E to be uniform throughout the length L, then V will be equal to EL. Ohm used general formula of current density to derive his formula, the Ohm's law, J is equal to sigma E. But we know that V is equal to EL and so E is equal to V by L. So J will be sigma V by L. But J is the current density, current by unit area. So I by A is equal to sigma V by L. We can rearrange and write it as V is equal to I into L divided by sigma A. This quantity L by sigma A could be named as R resistance. So V is equal to IR. R, R is equal to V by I. This is Ohm's law. This is the macroscopic form of Ohm's law. So the definition of the resistance could be written as the resistance is the ratio of potential difference across the given conductor to the current passing through the conductor. Its unit is ohm. The unit of resistance ohm is given to honor George Simon Ohm, the scientist who found out the formula for resistance. If a graph is drawn between voltage and current, the slope of it will be the resistance offered by the resistor. Only the materials who obey Ohm's law will give a straight line graph. As voltage increases, current increases steadily. Only conductors obey Ohm's law. They are also called as ohmic. Materials such as semiconductors, we are going to learn in unit 9, they do not follow Ohm's law. As potential increases, current does not increase steadily. They are known as non-ohmic materials. As we know, resistance R is equal to L by sigma A, where sigma is conductivity. Rho could be written as 1 by sigma, where rho is resistivity. That is, the reciprocal of conductivity is resistivity. And so, resistance could be written as R is equal to rho L by A. Electrical resistivity of a material is defined as the resistance offered to the current flow by a conductor of unit length having unit area of cross section. Unit of resistivity rows ohm meter. Unit of conductivity sigma is mo per meter. Evaluation questions derive macroscopic model of current, derive Ohm's law. What is resistivity? What is conductivity? What is the unit of resistance, resistivity and conductivity? Thank you. Thanks for watching. If there is any doubt, you can ask in the comment section. Thank you. Thanks for watching.